What is up guys, Ryan here, and welcome to Quest Mod Weekly, Week 1, and today we're going to do a Fallout New Vegas mod. Uh, tell me what you guys want me to do, I'm, I'm going to make this a weekly thing, but I don't know if I should make it like every weekend or whatever, uh, but that doesn't really matter, we'll figure it out. Uh, I'm not the best at commentating, so excuse me for this, but I'm getting better, but I before you watch the video, I'd ask if you guys can please just subscribe or thumbs up or do whatever you want with the video. Do something with it. Comment. Tell me what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong. Uh, I really appreciate that. I really would. But uh, today we're doing a, a mod that actually, it's in Prim, and you can actually rebuild the Bison and Steve Hotel. Or is it Bison Steve Hotel? Something like that. But you can totally rebuild it, do whatever you want with it. There's a series of quests involving it. It's fully voice acted. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy, and let's start this shit. So, to start the quest, you have to go in the Vicky and Vance Casino. I don't know exactly who to talk to, but I'm sure it's pretty straightforward. Hello? What are you doing here? Oh. This is our casino, punk. Where the hell does she come from? That's my life. <laughs> You've got Moxie, buddy. But we don't take kindly what, to What happened to all the people in here? Fuck. We lose again. <laughs> we heard was right for the picking, so figured we could come here and. Ah, right, whatever. Uh. Oh snap! Oh god! Holy shit! That was really loud. I'm sorry for that, but that was badass. You just raped them. I will take your ammo, and I will take your ammo, and your bottle caps. Where's the person where I blew off their head? I think it's, yeah. And I'll take your ammo. Alright, where is everybody? Alright, cool. Everyone ran away, I think. There's usually a lot more people in there. Steve. Well, I'll be damned. I heard through the grapevine you was still a-kicking. Hoped you might show up here. Yeah, this is fully voice acted, so I think this is it. Well, word is, is you damn near come back from the dead. Damn miracle, if you ask me. Yeah, this sounds custom voice acted. I'll bet you do. Way I figure it, you either got a golden horseshoe stuck up your ass, <laughs> or an angel on your shoulder uh, looking out for you. Either way, <laughs> the fuck? that kind of talent might come in handy on a project I'm working on. Or about that. Reckon I got ahead of myself. Name of Steve, as in Bison Steve. That's Bison yep. Steve. That old place has been what? in the family for years, and I aim to rebuild her. But I need your help. Them goddamn convicts took over the town and got us locked up in here tighter than a virgin at Gamora. <laughs> uh, Hell yeah. Now that's what we need around here, is somebody to take the damn Brahmin by the horns. That fucking beagle's a pussy. Anyhow, I need that hotel cleared fucking out big. and Granny's blueprints brung back to me. They's locked up in her safe up on the second floor. After that, you'll have to make sure things is peaceful enough around here for the town folk to get back to work. But the first thing I need is them blueprints. What do you say? A whole lot of fucking caps, that's what. <laughs> there ain't no this is really well voice acting. room around here for miles. If we can get some law in this town and get the old place fixed back up, we'd be set up to make a shitload of cash. You know what that makes us? It makes us partners. You ever wanted to stake in a casino? Here's your chance, partner. Definitely, and that sounds far. awesome. I was right about you after all. Listen, it ain't much, but here's a little stuff I stashed away for a rainy day just in case. Come back and see me when you got them prints and we'll go over the rest of the plan. Damn, I almost forgot. You'll need this key. Good luck and be careful. Alright, Bison Steve. Wall safe. So it gives me some ammo. I wasn't really paying attention, to be honest. I wasn't really listening. Go find Old Lori's blueprints. Where's that at? Okay. At least it's in town. Yeah, buddy. It's 
so I have to go back in here. Hello. I already blasted everybody in here, so. Hmm. Come on, Rex. Maybe you have to go up here. Yeah, it's probably upstairs. I haven't been up here before. Oh, wait, I think I went the wrong way. Uh, oh, no, okay. The hell? This pistol's awesome, by the way. It's called Mysterious Pistol. Whenever you pull it out, it makes a, <laughs> makes a noise. Let's see here. Oh, nothing but ammo and stuff. I will always take that, though. Nothing in the first aid? Are you serious? Oh, wall is safe. Oh. Sweet. Okay, I think we're good. Take the blueprints back to Steve. I'm lucky I got one guy again. That song plays every single time, dude. If you go on the strip or any casino, that song plays. Hey, you got them blueprints yet? Yes, I do, sir. Great job, partner. These prints give me a good idea how much more stuff we need. It looks like we should be able to salvage enough material from around the hotel to get the basic stuff done. Won't be much. Just walls and the floor, but it's a start. Hope this some is of the like town really folks are itching to get to work, but they advanced. won't hit a lick until we get some law in this town. The sooner we get a new sheriff, we have a new the sooner sheriff. we can get to cracking. Think you can help? Yeah, I see. <laughs> well, let's hope this new sheriff fares better than the last one, and God help us if he's anything like that retard Beagle. <laughs> that man couldn't find his own ass. Beagle actually on died. The seat. Hey. I need a minute or two to go over these prints and supplies, okay? Won't you go wet your whistle and come see me in a little spell? Uh, Beagle died when I came and rescued him, so <laughs> he's not even around anymore. What am I doing? I don't know your sword and print. Go check back with Steve for more instructions, okay? Hey, thanks for helping out the town. We got a lot riding on this. And let's hope that things stays peaceful around here for a while. We's got work to do. What are you doing? Well, now that we got a new sheriff, the workers can finish the demo and start getting the inside fixed up. Glad these town folk need something to do, cause with all the help we got, shouldn't take too long. But Sweet. the next thing we need to do is get all the lights installed. Hope this doesn't off. cost me caps. I think we can have that much. Plenty of the basic lights from around the hotel. But I just don't think anything we can dig up will work for the casino. For that, we just need something a lot nicer. I've been going through some of Grandma's journals and I found something interesting. Looks like old Buck Brunson had some lights ordered from some feller up in Vegas, but I ain't never heard of him. If we can find him and turn in this here order, they should be ready to ship if I read this right. Old Buck's niece, Anna, might know who this feller is. So you need to hightail it up to her and see what she knows. Uh, yeah. Hey, one last thing. Be sure and bring me a receipt. Don't know if we can trust this fella or not. Where is this at? I have to go all the way to New Vegas. Bucks play. Oh, man. I guess we can start here. I actually have a quite a bit of radio mods installed. I have a lot of mods installed. As, as you, shut up, Rex. As you can tell, the sky is really pretty. It's not very lore friendly because it's kind of looks like Skyrim. I mean, it's really not normal to have skies like this, even in an apocalypse, but it's whatever. I think it looks cool. Where do I need to go? I need to go over there. Which means I have to like go around, I suppose. Yeah. Look at that moon. Music goes perfectly right, right now. 
Oh man. It's a blast. I hope you guys can see. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna wait so you guys can probably see better. I know Fraps always records things a little darker than usual. And I don't feel like putting a brightness setting on. There we go. Recording, as you guys probably know, takes a lot of processing power, so... I don't know. It's just a lot harder on my computer to play this game while I'm recording. But here we go, Buck's place. Let's see what is up with Buck. Hopefully he doesn't shoot me in the face. That would be bad. Hope he has a giant epic beard. That'd be sweet. I love beards. As you can tell. Oh man, you can't even see my beard. You can see underneath, kinda. But yeah, I have it like a giant beard. Music is so loud. God. I think I've been here before. I'm not sure. This is a pretty nice place in the middle of the wasteland. Oh, it's a chick. Hello, can I help you with something? I'm trying to find Buck. I guess not. I know it's my uncle's. See these initials etched into it right here? That BB is Buck Brunson, but I don't recognize this NS right here. Wait, it's gotta be Nevada Slim. He and Uncle were old poker buddies. They even started the new Mojave poker series together with Stewie and Pearson. They had a bit of a falling out, I'm afraid. Buck bluffed him off a real big hand one night. Thousands of caps at stake. Buck was a little drunk, and he showed Slim his cards just for spite. That made Slim real mad. Yeah, he did. But Slim don't like to be bluffed like that. Said Buck was making fun of him. Of course, Buck wasn't, but that didn't matter to Slim. Slim said their friendship was over, swore he'd get his money back somehow, and stormed out. I don't think they've spoken since. Buck headed out for New Reno a day or so later. New Reno? It's a shame, because they had been through a lot together and were old, old friends. He's probably drunk, gambling, or most likely both. He always said he liked Gamora. Okay, bye. Ugh, Gamora. I hate that place. <laughs> it's, uh, quite annoying. But yeah, the Gamora is a casino on the... On the What's it called? Over here, actually. At the strip. The strip. By the way, uh, speaking of the Ultra Lux, that reminds me, I, the White Glove Society absolutely fucking hates me, so I can't even step foot in that casino. It sucks, because there's some really cool uh, quests in there. Why am I waiting? But, uh, yeah. I accidentally shot one. <laughs> now the whole white glove society hates me. I was too lazy just to roll back on a save, so I just went on with it. Fuck the white glove society anyway, man. They're a bunch of cannibals. Some of you probably even know what I'm talking about. <laughs> God, I hate the lag. Annoying. I'm sorry, guys. New Vegas, believe it or not, is actually a pretty hard game to run. Uh, I run Skyrim better than this game. I don't know why. Skyrim, I get a full 60. Hey, no one but Omerta's or. Yeah, 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 yeah. 